Praise God. We are here with Jeanette Harris and spread the word right here, WPGR. Oh, praise God. <laughs> That's it. Uh. <laughs> I thought you was going to bring me on a little bit more, girl. I'm sorry. That's all right. Sorry. No, I'm ready. I, I got like to be like ready. You like to be on time. I you got like to, to be on time. Done, get so it done. Get That's in. right. We got you in late. Y'all yeah, because we're going to have some fun today, boy. We're going to have some God. fun today. But we just want to welcome you all to Spread the Word and I Am Production. I'm Jeanette Harris, your host for the hour. And uh, we got an exciting show for you today. As you know, on this um, broadcast, we interview entertainers live on the show and they perform for us live as well. So we're going to introduce you to a Christian comedian who goes by the name of Simply Shirley. Now we know that the Word of God says a merry heart doeth good like medicine. So um, we're going to um, bring on Sister Shirley and, um, and interview her today and um, she's going to give us a sample of her work. Shirley and I, uh, she's a good friend of mine. Yes. She's a sweetheart. That's right. We both are members of Evangel Cathedral and she's a performer who makes people laugh and she's here today to share with us how she got into this field and she's going to be putting some laughter into our hearts today and um, you know so sit back and, and enjoy the show uh, when I'm in this sphere I go by Simply Shirley and I like that yeah, I, I like that okay I like that. that's what I was trying to explain to him I said but that's her MO Simply Shirley yeah. he said but don't call her Simply Shirley. I said, no, she's Simply Shirley. So I had to go back. We, we went back and forth with that. But you know, I have a lot of friends, and, and, and really, when we're talking, and then someone will say, what's her last name? <laughs> and I'll look at them like, uh, and it's almost a shame that you know someone for so long and don't know their last name. Right, yeah. right. So Shirley, uh, what made you decide to become a comedian? Well, you know, um, it goes quite a way back. Uh, what I did, actually, was... On a dare, I joined, uh, I participated in a talent show. And it was a church talent show, so I decided uh, I wanted to do something a little different, not so much churchy, as we say, uh, poetry. I thought about the poetry at first, and that's really not me, because the only poetry I know is what I learned in kindergarten. And I didn't want to sing because that would run everybody out to church. So I decided to do something totally different, <laughs> something that was, had been in my sphere. You're funny, for a long girl, already. And, and, and I decided to do comedy. And what I did is I just put a, a, a short skit together, a couple of minutes, and went out and did it on just completely, you know, out of the air. Won the talent show, and that sort of planted a seed in me. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. It lay dormant for a while, but uh, after I retired, I decided let me just go, you know, try a second career. Mm-hmm. Usually, when you retire, you know. Uh, at first, I just sat around the house. Mm -hmm. Didn't know exactly what I wanted to do. Mm -hmm. So for a while, I just sat around making prank phone calls. <laughs> <laughs> so somewhere between the, the, the Price is Right and the Young and the Restless, uh -huh. I decided, uh, I better find something else to do. <laughs> Price is Right, Young and the Restless, okay. <laughs> so uh, somebody told me that comedians only work like 15 or 20 minutes a day. Mm -hmm. I said, that's something I can do. There you go. Good, good. good job after retirement. Mm -hmm. So I decided to give it a shot. We can have, we have kids here in the audience, to our listening audience. We have children here in the studio. Now, see, so you can't just bring any comedian. Come on over here, girl. You can't just bring any comedian in and have them tell jokes around children. Y'all come over here. How did you like Simply Shirley? Good. Was she funny? Yes. Yeah, I saw you over there laughing, y'all. Huh? What was the funniest joke to you? When um, she dropped down on the floor to get her earring. When she dropped down on the floor to get her earring? What about you? Uh, when she said his voice changed and he said you oh. drug your parcels to me. I thought that was the one. I thought that was the one because he laughed so hard back there. He was like, oh. All right. So those are, you know, those are, Keisha, what about you? What, what was the one that got you? Do you remember? Uh, well, one, when she said everybody around, says that, uh, you look like someone. I get that all the time, too. Mm -hmm. I get it all the time. I was Gina in uh, high school, or I don't know what it but, uh, I remember when gas was only 75 cents a gallon. Ooh, Come on. Yes. 75 cents a gallon. Mm -hmm. Now, I know that's unheard of for you young people, but, you know, uh, back then, you you know, you could give somebody a ride and they'd say, you want money for gas? Mm -hmm. yeah, no, no, that's okay. I got yep. this. I got this. Mm -hmm. Don't even take the money. <laughs> right. Now, I got my girlfriend's car now. the other day. She had a little cup over on the passenger side. <laughs> Seed money for gas. <laughs> yeah. I might have to do that. Yeah. <laughs> Me too, okay. You ever give somebody a ride, you know, and they live a little further than, they, than you thought? Mm -hmm. Yeah. You'd be like, 
Oh, when you said Virginia, I didn't think you meant Richmond. Oh, okay. come on. Or, <laughs> <laughs> well, you know, you give somebody a ride sometimes, and then before they get... Before you take them home, they got to run all their errands. Oh, uh, yes. Could, could you stop me past the drugstore, please, for the, to pick up my prescription? Yeah. And I put a couple of items from the, 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 the Safeway. <laughs> and let me stop past my mother's house to get dinner. <laughs> and use up all your gas. <laughs> use up all your gas. <laughs> You know, and the thing about it is, the Lord just blessed yeah. me with a new car. Just blessed me oh, with a new car. Oh, praise God. Amen. Yeah. Woo! Praise God. Yeah. Have a good ride. Have a good ride. Yeah, I prayed mm-hmm. and asked the Lord for a new car. Hallelujah. And he blessed me. Amen. But I forgot to ask for money for gas. Oh, okay. <laughs> You know, so you have to be specific. They tell you all the time. You be have specific to be specific when you pray. When you pray. Yes. Lord, I need a new car mm-hmm. and money for gas. Mm-hmm. Yes. Right? Mm-hmm. That's right? Lord, I need a husband. Mm-hmm. Uh-oh. With a job. <laughs> hey, with a job. Yes. A husband with a job. You hear that, kids? You got to be specific. <laughs> yeah. Can we say good job? <laughs> good job. <laughs> yeah. Not McDonald's. Well, praise God for all the jobs. I'm not going to say that because nowadays it's hard getting a job. In a yes. bank account. <laughs> yes, and a bank account, with something yeah, in. Bank account. <laughs> at least, at least, come yeah. on. And I was just thinking, you know, we we, we all survived the snow, right? Mm-hmm. Yes. Yeah. So snow, something. Ooh. Mm. Oh, yes. oh my goodness! And you sit in the house, you have Kevin fever after a while. Oh, yes. You know, you start off. Oh, the snow is so pretty. Mm-hmm. Snow is so yeah. pretty. Uh-huh. That's day one. <laughs> okay. Day two, we got to get out here and shovel this. Ooh, oh, you yes. Said yes. Then th- by day three, you're getting sick of the people in your house. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> 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 Get out! You know, now, take that you know what? Pretty well with me and my husband. Mm-hmm. You know, we, we did we did pretty good. We didn't get on each other's nerves. Mm-hmm. You know, we respected each other's privacy. Mm-hmm. But what happened was, our dog got a little aggravated with us. Oh, yeah! It's like she she got mad because we were in home. <laughs> <laughs> and after a few days, she was, she just kept looking at us like, "When y'all going to?" <laughs> <laughs> So about day four into the snow, look like she couldn't take it anymore. She went out back. We saw her digging in the snow, trying to make a pass. <laughs> Simply Shirley, thank you so much. And I'm kids. Tell us what one of your um, favorite jokes was that she said. I like never would have made it without shoes. <laughs> never. Tell, put us in the mic where we can hear you. I like never would have made it without shoes. You do. What? Tell us what your name is. Zayana. Zayana, how old are you? Thirteen. Thirteen years old. You see, surely can make the kids smile and laugh. What about you? What was your favorite one? Tell us your name. Zayara. Zyra, she's five years old. Four. four. four? Oh, oh, she's wow. four years old. Okay, Zyra, what was your favorite one? When she said that the dog, <laughs> the dog wanted to go outside. He was getting tired of them and all that snow. It was about when you said something. Oh, I said something crazy? Because I'm a crazy lady sometimes. <laughs> now what about you, Brother Zion? <laughs> what was yours? On the, in the mic. Uh, um. <laughs> now Zion wants to be a, a Christian comedian. I can tell. Mm-hmm. What about the Beyonce one? That's my favorite. No. What about <laughs> what's yours, Keisha? Now, that is my favorite. I got to tell you right now. I'm gonna go ahead and let you know. I'm gonna use. I that think one. I'm gonna use that I got one too. To tell some people I, that I, one. I think I I'm really gonna use do. that one, Shirley. Shirley, you so crazy.